What's up Savage Family, it's Tan Savage and I'm tuning you in to another video. Today I'm going to be making KFC's famous chicken bowls. You know the mashed potato bowls with all the gravy, the chicken, the corn, the cheese, the all that good stuff. Yeah, so I'm gonna be making that at home today. I never made it before, but it's pretty simple. Pretty simple ingredients. I absolutely used to love those bowls and I was never a fan of KFC chicken. And if I was to get that in dying need, to eat then I would go to that because that's like the only chicken that seemed real to me but anyways I'm gonna make that tonight for dinner and you just cooking with tan today we're making a cooking video today right here we got the chicken breast um, I could have got tenders but it's all getting cut up so it's gonna cook the same uh, the milk for the mashed potatoes I am making the mashed potatoes from scratch and then um, I'm gonna have these biscuits on the side and uh, this is the corn, the cheese, and then I'm going to make gravy from scratch, or I might, I don't know, depending how long this takes, but I got this for backup because gravy from scratch is never enough. So yeah, basically very, very simple ingredients, and we just gonna get right into it. Let's go. All right, you guys, I got the hard part out the way. I peeled all the potatoes, and I made a huge mistake thinking that this little bag is enough. Like, I could probably eat all that by myself. I'm that greedy. Okay, you guys, so um, I'm gonna just cut these chicken into big pieces because you don't want them like super small. You want them uh, like little chicken nuggets, basically. For y'all that don't know what cooking scissors are, these are in fact cooking scissors. And if you ain't up on it, go get you some, for real. Me, I personally think this is much easier than a knife, much faster. Okay, you guys I did a little milk bath for that and while that is soaking for like 10 minutes I'm gonna start the potatoes in the corn yeah this is definitely not enough potatoes for all of us but we gonna improvise okay this is sweet corn and I'm not putting anything but butter and sugar in here I almost made two cans but I kind of feel like that's enough and I don't know if I'm just hungry because I feel like I can eat all this shit all of it Okay, you guys, it's 20 minutes until my potatoes are done boiling. So, with that being said, it's 15 minutes to make my biscuits, and I want my chicken to be fresh. So, I do have my chicken over here ready to start frying, but I'm going to wait until the biscuits, maybe when I put the biscuits in, that's when I'm going to start frying this, which is in four minutes. Y'all, I cannot wait, bitch, I'm so hungry. Like, I almost ate a whole loaf of bread just because I'm hungry right now. But I love biscuits so much, I'm about to eat like three or four of them things. <laughs> I'm about to eat three or four of them things. I couldn't even eat no bread, but everything looking good. I can't wait to eat. <laughs> Anyways, guys, how was y'all day going? It's been a super gloomy day today, and I just been pretty much chilling at home all day. I left for a little bit, but I just came back home. I took a little nap. When it's like gloomy outside, y'all, am I the only one that just want to sleep all day? Like, I will sleep the whole day away on the gloomy day. Don't play with me. It's 17 minutes left on the timer, and I'm just about to prep my biscuits and fry this chicken. Y'all, am I the only one that get confused when you open the biscuit can? They be confusing me like, are they supposed to be this way or that way? Cause not all the time they have the little circle at the top. I wonder if I put it in the wrong way, would they like rise differently? 
Y'all, how do y'all test to see if y'all oil ready? I just sprinkle a little water in that thing. If y'all don't have no kitchen tongs, y'all gotta get up on it. It's like very convenient and super easy to use these things. Y'all, it smell like KFC in here, but 10 times better. Very well seasoned, smell very good. I can't wait. And the corn looking good. Okay, y'all, I'm gonna start this little chicken gravy mix and I'm gonna put it in here. My camera is dying, so I will get back to y'all when I'm finished. Y'all, I want a dessert so bad. I didn't even get no dessert ingredients at all. I don't know what to get. I think I might just go like to a restaurant or something to get dessert just because I want some so bad. But look at this chicken. That chicken looking so good. So good. All right, you guys, just the mashed potatoes. And yes, I'm using the ice cream scoop. Those are the corn. I almost caught that green piece. And this is the chicken. Okay, you guys, here's the biscuits. And I feel like I'm kind of rushing now because my camera is dead. So I don't know how much more I can record. Um, but I'll show you when I plate the food. Okay, y'all, so I'm kind of annoyed that I didn't use the brown gravy because it will look a little darker but overall it's chicken gravy so it should be good this looks too good I cannot wait to dive in and then I'm about to eat me like three biscuits yummy y'all I definitely went and got me a little dessert I could not resist that looked so good. <laughs> I know y'all gonna get tired of me saying that, but it's true. Y'all, I've been getting a little too happy with food lately. I know y'all can y'all can tell, y'all can see it. I've been a little too happy, y'all. I cannot help it. Like, I love me some food. That's why I just need to get disciplined. Like, at first, I was, like, in control to where I can eat good for, like, majority of the day and most days and have a little slip up and then go back to my healthy eating you know something like a cheat day but lately i've been getting a little carried away and i've been eating like i've been eating fast food greasy food all kind of yummy food and big portions at that so i'm trying to get that back under control but for some reason i can't get it back under control man like no matter how hard i try i was doing so good y'all but i'm about to get back to it but i'm about to eat this little dessert right here y'all my food was like so good my food was like too good like for real for real that's probably like one of the best meals i ever made Nah, i ain't gonna lie like that like it was too good <laughs> y'all i'm gonna drag that out because it was too good anyways i'm about to eat this little dessert and whatnot and watch me a little show it's early it's nine o'clock and yeah i did want to ask y'all though do y'all like when i do cooking videos because i don't know y'all never give me feedback all i see is the views people watching but they don't really interact y'all ain't gotta be shy just talk to me do you like the cooking videos or not yes or no yes or no it's not that hard to respond it's not that okay Woosa. okay but anyways like and comment on this video subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my videos give me a big thumbs up if you have any feedback or if you want to see certain videos from me just comment down below guys do not be shy if you watch my videos 10 times out of 10 really appreciate you i am thankful that you acknowledge me i'm thankful that you acknowledge and enjoy my content i'm not mean i'm not bitter i'm not evil and if you're just gonna keep watching and not interacting that's fine thank Thank you for your view <laughs> thank you but anyways i'm about to go y'all um i feel like i'm talking too much am i talking too much thought so <laughs> thanks for watching my videos stay okay i'm <laughs> enough with the stay tuned let's dead that right now dead that right there yeah but see you in the next video though peace